Basketball season started up again, guys. And here's my starting lineup and another Fast Five. Welcome back to Sense Sense, guys. I'm Joshua, and as always, to my loyal subscribers, thank you. And to all my new viewers, and hopefully new subscribers, welcome in, guys. This is gonna be my entry into the Jeremy Fragrance Contest. Jeremy, thank you so much for giving us reviewers a chance to get in the game. In this review, we're gonna go over five fragrances and five players. A fragrance for each position and a player that reminds me of that fragrance. The best point guard in today's NBA, in my opinion, is Steph Curry. Nobody on the court makes everyone else around him better than Steph Curry. And that's what a point guard does best. He compliments other players. He assists other players. And what fragrance assists other fragrances better than any other fragrance on the market? What fragrance is great to blend with other fragrances and meshes well and highlights the other fragrance? Nothing does it better than Molecule 01. Molecule 01 is a very light fragrance. It's mostly used in the fragrance community to blend with other fragrances. You spray a couple sprays of this on, and you spray another fragrance on top. It increases the longevity of that fragrance, and it makes it smell a whole lot better. The main note in this is ISO E Super, which is basically a chemical that just makes everything else around it smell better. And much like Steph Curry, he makes every other player on the court better just by his mere presence. The point guard position is not only Steph Curry, but also Molecule 01. Coming in at the two position is my shooting guard. That's the guy who gets the job done. He's the one who puts points on the board. And who better to do that than the greatest player of all time, Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan got the job done. Assists, steals, rebounds, blocks, they're all cute. But guess what? At the end of the day, the team with the most points wins. And that's what Michael Jordan did. He in crunch time, he got the ball in his hands, he put the ball in the basket. And the fragrance that best exemplifies him is Michael Jordan legend. <laughs> no, not Michael Jordan legend. Versace Dillon Blue. Versace Dillon Blue is a great fragrance and it definitely gets points. And in a fragrance game, we call that compliments. Versace Dillon Blue perfectly exemplifies Michael Jordan and what he brought to the game because he put points on the board. And that's what this fragrance does, it gets you compliments. So coming in at the two position is Versace Dillon Blue and Michael Jordan. Starting at the three position in my starting lineup is a small forward unlike any other small forward. He is also known as the king. LeBron James, that's right, all hell King James. The small forward in basketball is the guy on the court that's usually the best athlete. He can shoot, he can rebound, he can steal, he can score, he can assist, he can do everything. He's very fast, he's very agile. He's an all around complete player. And what fragrance to better exemplify that than the king of fragrances, King Creed Aventus. We all know what this fragrance does, and we all know what LeBron James does. It does anything you need it to do. When a player goes down at a different position, LeBron James can step into that position. From the one to the five, he can do it all. And that's what Creed Aventus can do. Fall, winter, summer, spring, it doesn't matter. This fragrance is one of the most complete fragrances I've ever put my nose upon. And just like LeBron on the court, this is the king of fragrances. Coming in at the number three position, the small forward, that's Creed Aventus and LeBron James. Coming in at the four spot is the power forward. He's a guy who's very polarizing. Everybody knows who he is because he's usually the most vocal. He's a guy who's a bruiser, he's a guy who gets low, he's loud and most often obnoxious. And what power forward in the NBA exemplifies that the best? Draymond Green. And much like Draymond Green, there's a fragrance that you either love or you hate. But at the end of the day, you can't deny that it gets the job done. And that's Paco Rabanne's One Million. There's no questioning that Paco Rabanne's One Million is the most polarizing fragrance in the community. And much like Paco Rabanne, Draymond Green is definitely that in basketball. This fragrance definitely gets the job done. It works, it lasts, it's loud, it's boisterous, but guys, you know some people won't admit it that they love this thing. And a lot of people won't admit it when they love Draymond Green. But guess what? It gets the job done, and so does he. Coming in at the four spot, at the power four position, we got Draymond Green and Paco Rabanne's one million. Rounding out my starting lineup at the five spot is the center position. The center position in today's NBA is completely different than it used to be before. 
Gone are the Shaquille O'Neal's and the Kim Elijah ones. The guys who used to bang down low and dominate, getting quick passes from the outside and slamming the ball down. Now, the center position has evolved. These guys are just as tall and just as big, but they're more muscular and they're faster and they can shoot from all over the court. And no player better exemplifies that than Anthony Davis. He's definitely the backbone of the New Orleans Pelicans and he's definitely an evolved version of the center position. He can definitely play the four, he can also play the five, and he can shoot from anywhere on the court. And one fragrance that's definitely evolved from what it used to be, and is definitely, in my opinion, better than it used to be, is Aqua De Gio Profumo. Just like Anthony Davis, Aqua De Gio has definitely evolved with this new Profumo version. Just like today's NBA game has evolved, the fragrance game has evolved. So people's noses have changed. Aqua De Gio Profumo is definitely a well-rounded, balanced fragrance, and it will definitely get the job done. And it will definitely do things that you don't expect it to do. It'll get you compliments, but it'll also last for a long time as a fresh scent. And just like the center position, you don't expect three-pointers and shots from outside, but Anthony Davis can also get that job done. So coming at the number five position, Anthony Davis is joined by Aqua De Gio Profumo. Wait, you guys thought the list was done? Every starting five needs a sixth man. The sixth man is a guy who comes in and brings fresh legs. He's the guy who revitalizes the team and brings an energetic approach. And nobody does that better in the fragrance community than Jeremy Fragrance. No offense to the veteran fragrance reviewers, you know I love you, but Jeremy has definitely brought a fresh take to the fragrance community. His mere popularity has drawn an eye to the fragrance community, and it's definitely invited new people and brought fresh faces into it. And it's definitely made every single one of us reviewers more popular. So the fragrance that I chose for the six man position, the fragrance that I think perfectly exemplifies the fresh take that Jeremy has brought to the fragrance community is Creed's Virgin Island Water. Yep, Creed's Virgin Island Water. It brings a spark, it's revitalizing, and it has a fresh take. That's a fragrance that I think is definitely a six man in any man's rotation. Even though very polarizing and often hated on, Jeremy has definitely revitalized the fragrance community and brought in fresh faces and definitely influenced new reviewers. So Jeremy, thank you for this opportunity and thank you for giving other reviewers like me a shot to get noticed. All right guys, that about does it for me. I definitely hope you vote for this video and I definitely hope you like, share, comment, and subscribe. As always guys, have a good day. I'll smell you later. Peace.